festival of trees over at Turner Dodge House. Mm -hmm. um, we have 62 trees decorated on all three floors of the historic mansion, decorated by various businesses, organizations, and individuals. Mm -hmm. um, it's a great family event um, for to come and see all of the trees on all three floors. Um, it's a fundraiser for the Friends of Turner Dodge House. All the proceeds for, from this event go to help support and promote and preserve the historic mansion in Old Town. So not only are you going to be able to go out and kind of check out these beautiful trees, get in the holiday spirit, but also support the Turner Dodge House. How important is it for the community to do that? It's very important right now. You know, uh, t the Turner Dodge Mansion is probably one of the last historic homes in the Lansing area that's open to the public. Um, it is owned by the city of Lansing, and uh, we partner with uh, Lansing Parks and Recreations to put on this uh, Festival of Trees event. It's mm -hmm. our biggest fundraiser, my friends group, and um, like I said, the money raises, you know, it helps support and preserve the mansion. Um, it's just great, it's a great uh, uh, family event, and the home is beautiful to come and see and get mm -hmm. some of the history from the event you know, from the mansion, it's just wonderful. So let's talk about these trees. Are, are they all different? Are they decorated uniquely? T tell me more about oh, the visual things that kids will see when they come in. 62 differently decorated trees. We've got a tree from the Capillary District Library that's done all out of books, mm -hmm. which is very cool. We have a tree uh, done by the Ari Olds Transportation Museum that's all made out of tires, vintage tires. Oh, how neat. It's very cool. Yeah. Um, one of the really cool trees is a tree that's it's a breast cancer survivor tree. Oh, wow. And it uh, helps promote uh, women who have survived breast cancer. So mm -hmm. if somebody has survived breast cancer, if a lady is, or any, if you know somebody that has survived breast cancer, they can put their name on the tree, which helps you know support and promote that. Mm -hmm. um, we have a couple different trees done by Potter Park Zoo. One of the trees uh, is a conservation tree that um, showcases the conservation of this rare, exotic South American frog. Oh, wow. um, it's just. The creativity of some of these trees is unbelievable. You just have to come and see them. I mean, it's just, it's so cool, right, yeah, to see all this. And if those at home do want to stop by and take it all in, the holiday magic, um, taking the holiday magic, the Festival of Trees is open to the public again at Turner Dodge House. Admission is $5. And for hours or more info, visit the website on your screen. And you know what? It does sound like a really good time. We'll be talking to you again in the next hour as well. Beverly, well, how about a check on that weather?